Okay, welcome to another, uh, oh, I just broke my second pair of glasses. Awesome. Anyways, welcome to another episode of Nate falls through the deck joist because he didn't plan this out and he's not Houdini, but I'm going to try and show you guys. Oh boy. All right, we're in. Okay, it's super dark in here. Welcome to our house. So, as you can see, we did all the lookouts. I don't know what I showed you guys last time. So we did all the lookouts that we need to. We still have one more piece that has to go in there. We did all the blocking. And we put our tentative ceiling board up. I cleared out all of the supports. I even swept. Pretty big deal. And this is our bedroom. Her closet, his closet, bed, reading nook under the window, fireplace, patio door, wobamo, and decorative cabinet that goes behind the door. You open it like this. Yes. And the windows are cut out like this because I'm waiting for BDP to show up and do his um, favorite task, which is router the windows. Also, we noticed a lot of neighbors were looking in and gawking. Uh, actually, not neighbors, because I like the neighbors, but the rest of the people are looking in and gawking. So I just decided to cut out the window into a decorative piece. So you can see that perfectly from the highway. It's pretty nice. See? Anyways. So tonight, what I'm gonna do, and what I'm about to do, is I'm going to time lapse. Uh, Jamie and I are going to do the deck. We're in a crazy rush because my sister's staying in Doe's coming up this weekend. Hey. What? Where are my gloves? They're over there on the thing. They're wet. Oh. Anyways, okay, so we're in a crazy rush. But what we did is we're doing six by six uh, railing posts. We're gonna put up a railing. But first we're gonna do all of our deck boards so that tomorrow we can put up our beam and then we can put up our rafters after we put up the ledger board up there somewhere-ish. And that's the plan. So I stripped all the deck. So we had plywood and stuff on it. I stripped that out today. And now we are going to time-lapse, whoa, doing the deck because Everybody loves a juicy video of a nice deck, if you know what I mean. Hey, I'm Nate, and a while ago we sold everything we had in the city to move to the country and build a dream <laughs> life. Um, <laughs> here we are. <laughs> now I know this won't be easy, but with help from family, yeah, here we go. friends, they tried to kill me with a tree, and maybe even a few oddballs, Buddy. we're gonna make this work. Oh, no. Here on Nate in the Woods.
Okay, me and uh, the safety advisor do a little walk around. So we went to late last night, mosquitoes got really bad. And uh, so we tried to get as much deck as we could last night done. We finished up a bit of it this morning. It's coming along. So that's the deck. I started putting on the railing just to stabilize those boards because we had to take all the stabilizers off. Oh, I just remembered this is super dangerous for him. So we're gonna go down the stairs, show you on the outside. Instead, come on bud, come on, come on. Slow poke. It's because he just woke up and it's like three in the afternoon. So Jamie had to run to her shop and uh, what we were able to get done this morning, which was awesome because we've been waiting for a long time, as you guys know, is that board right there, the nightmare board. So we did all our lookouts, as you guys can see, all the way along there. And then I just have the back piece of blocking still to do in there. And the very front piece, once we get the fascia board on there. Cool view from inside the patio door. Anyways, so that's on there. Excuse me. That means that I can finish the roof. So what I'm going to do is I, because I'm only one person and I'm not that tough, I can't get those boards up there because they're two by 12s and I don't feel that strong. And I have lots of sawdust in my eye. Anyways, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go finish the roof as much as I possibly can. And then I will start to put out the weather watch or weather mat or something like that. It's this thing. So we're going to cover, typically you only do the problem areas with that stuff, apparently. Um, we're just going to do the whole roof. Because, because, whatever, fill in any excuse you want. So, I'm going to cut those boards, finish all that stuff, and then I'll do that on the roof. Now, I'm probably just going to blast through this because uh, there's no point in filming it, as you guys have seen the roof about a thousand times. Then, tomorrow... We're gonna get the beam up on those posts and the ledger board. I guess you call it a ledger board. I don't really know. Let's call it a ledger board on the house. Start the rafters and then I can do rafters all day sheathing. And then if I have some of that weather watch or weather match or whatever it is that asphalt roll on stuff, the same stuff we used on the bunkie. If I have more of that stuff, then we'll uh, put that on the deck. That's pretty much it for now. And we have family coming over too. I think they're supposed to be here soon and it looks like it's gonna rain. So I'm gonna hurry up. Okay, welcome to another uh, day, not episode, of Nate in the Woods. Maybe it's a new episode, who knows. So, what Jamie is doing, before she has to go around the shop, pulling that OT, so what she's doing is we're gonna put up that really long ledger board. I fastened that as a beam yesterday. I have to hammer it down. We just let it kind of, you know, we gotta sort that out. We gotta knock that stuff out. Anyways. What she's doing up there right now is she's gonna measure in from the sidewall to make sure it's the exact same as down there with this measuring tape. Let's see if she can make it. Oh, could she make it? Anyways, while she's doing that. Okay, so the plan is we're gonna do, put that board up, cut these beams, or sorry, cut those posts, and then we're going to put that beam up there with the brackets. Hopefully get two rafters. We have exactly 58 minutes before she has to leave. So we'll see if we can get that done. And I have to help her put this thing up on the wall. So I will just leave it to a time lapse and you guys can watch us struggle. All right. Okay, so she actually got it. Look at that. What a pro. But now it's time lapse.
So, as you can see, we got the board up, we got all those marked, and we ran out of time. So, what's gonna happen? Oh, we also got the beam cut after 50 lines of, I don't know what the heck I was thinking. And I had to nail some extra nails in there because it's 24 foot, uh, two by 12, so you could imagine how crooked it is. But when I was cutting it, I noticed that when I heard a loud bang while I was cutting the other board that may or may not have nails in it yesterday, I wasn't paying attention. Uh, yeah, so we are missing a tooth right there and right there. Just wait, there's more right there. Just wait, there's more right there. Yeah, it's about every uh, fourth tooth. So I have to go to the store. As usual, I have to pick up a crap ton of lumber. Um, maybe I'll bring you guys along. Not into the store though, because people will look at me weird, but. Oh, also, we just heard the first rumor about the house. Apparently, this is a rumor from somebody in town that because we're building the house on piers, we're just building it here and then we're gonna lift it somewhere else after. So, fun facts. I uh, don't think we're gonna do that. But, I mean, it's a good guess instead of just asking us. two weeks before we got our permit uh, and due to our competitive nature which is an unhealthy habit and should be changed uh, yeah we're competing with them to see who builds the house first and looks good I know these guys are good to go you can tell just the way they frame and stuff you know you can just tell the way they they work the way they work it it's hard to say anyways so I'm gonna show you guys the progress on their house and granted it has a poured basement but like i said or i think it might be a crawl space like i said oh cyclists hey uh like i said it's uh we're beating them so it doesn't matter beating the pants off though okay check it out yeah if you didn't catch that well i don't know what to tell you you gotta glue your eyes open on this channel okay stick it out all right let's continue the crappiest time lapse ever We are back from the lumber store and I just found a friggin pencil so that's sweet and I have three that I can lose today pretty exciting so we're back we're back look how good that board looks look at it right bammo anyways so I'm gonna well I'm alone now so I'm gonna do whatever I want and what I want to do is Look at how frustrating this was. That happened yesterday. On top of the other blade. Oh, in the hardware store, unfortunately, they didn't have the blade. And where we are, there's only a handful of hardware stores and none of them have it. And I don't feel like driving 45 minutes. So we're gonna cut with a partially toothless blade. So first, we're gonna finish the deck. I got deck lumber. We're gonna do all that. That's the sound that's gonna make. Then, Listen to that echo. Hello. 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 Then, because I'm alone and I'm not the Incredible Hulk, I'm sure you guys have like 50 different ways you could do this. Like I mentioned, I got strapping. Oh. So I got strapping. So I'm going to put strapping all along there at 11 feet because that's how high our faux ceiling is going to be. 
So in case I haven't explained this, it's gonna go up. Actually, I can just show you. It's gonna go up and then boom. And then the two by six ties in there, ties in there. And um, so how I'm gonna do that alone is I'm gonna find seven feet. Wait, is it seven feet? Yeah, whatever 11 feet is, I'll find over there and I'll put a bunch of strapping in a line here. And then I'll put a bunch of strapping in the line there. Once I'm content that the strapping is all level and deadly, then I can just slip the two by eights in there. Yeah, I hope I can, we'll see. But yeah, I should be able to. So then I can just slip them all in, then I'm gonna get down, double check, make sure everything's good to go. And then I can nail them all in. So that's gonna be a bit of a process. Anyway, so we're gonna work on the deck, then I'm gonna do that. It's gonna be a bunch of time-lapse stuff. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm starving. So send some food, please, and help, help. Oh, and if I get time today, I'm gonna put these in that, that thing. But I don't think we're gonna get there. I always over expect under deliver for myself. So time lapse now. Alrighty then, folks. So, the deck is done. That's it, look at that. Unsolicited deck video. Yeah. Anyways, it's good, pretty good. So I still have a bit of a gap there, but obviously we still have insulation that's gotta come out and all this stuff, blah, 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 blah. I don't really know how to finish that, so I'll probably have to pull up that last board. When I go to do the siding, insulation, all that, but that's, it's like, really far away so I'm not worried about it anyways so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna take a brief break because someone's a sweaty fat kid and we're gonna move up into the next stage I don't even know what time it is 
it's 140 not that that's applicable to you guys because it's probably going to be september by the time we get this out but next we're going to do this stuff to get all those so i gotta let this camera cool down because it's in direct sunlight and it's really flickery but uh i also have to cool down and i have to organize all my lumber so that is the plan and i'll uh see you guys after after i eat have a pop maybe a gatorade who knows all right goodbye Okay, so I have everything laid out, good to go. So now it's just a matter of putting it up there. I'm gonna take a brief break and then uh, answer some emails and stuff and then put everything up there. And we're gonna use the laser level. And if that doesn't work, then I might have to wait for the sun to go down a bit more. Um, but yeah, that's the plan. So that's mostly what's laid out. I probably could have got away with two by fours, but the, the house drawing said two by sixes. So whatever. We just spend the money. It's all good. Beauty day though. 